We have new information tonight about the deadly truck crash last night at the Holiday Gas Station in Launce. John Truitt has the details. One man has died and another person was hospitalized after a semi-truck veered off US-41 and crashed into the gas pumps, killing one man, then crashing into the gas station itself just after 11 p.m. Thursday night. The crash caused a major fire that consumed the entire property. Troopers from the Calumet Post were dispatched to the scene. Our troopers on scene began further investigation and uh, discovered it. The tractor trailer had uh, ran off the road into the Holiday gas station parking lot, struck a vehicle that was pumping gas, and continued further colliding into the Holiday gas station. The victim, identified by Lake Superior Performance Rally officials as 43-year-old Al Dantes Jr. of Lance, was transported to Barriga County Memorial Hospital, where he was later pronounced dead. A father of six girls, Dantes was a member of the Lance Area School Board and was currently running for a seat on the Barriga County Commission. Dantes was set to compete in the Lake Superior Performance Rally Championship Series where he was leading his class in points. Former teammates and fellow racers all said Dantes was not only a good friend and a great competitor, but he was always the first to come to the assistance of anyone in need. He was there in his truck in front of us with, you know, full of people helping some new team out, you know, showing them the ropes, and we were just laughing and joking around. That was yeah, less than 24 hours ago, and big, big old smile on his face like he always had. Larger than life. Um, he was this immense character, and uh, everybody knows Al. Every, no one has a negative story about him. Like, there's always a memory. Um, there's really no, no one like him. His, his presence on media, his presence uh, just at rallies, and he's always having a good time. A holiday employee was also transported to the hospital for injuries sustained from the crash. A holiday store patron, as well as a trainee who was a passenger in the semi-truck at the time of the crash, were not injured. The driver of the semi-truck, a 22-year-old Illinois man, is lodged in the Barriga County Jail for operating while intoxicated and causing death. He is expected to be arraigned on Monday. The scene turned into an OWI investigation. Our troopers eventually arrested the truck driver of the tractor semi for OWI. The crash shut down portions of US-41 well into the morning hours. The Michigan State Police are continuing to investigate. John Truett, Local 3 News.